Yo, what's going on YouTube? It is your boy Ears. Hope you guys are having a good rest of your day, start of your day, whatever time it may be. For today's video, we're looking at all of my 16 class setups that I've kept from you. Now, a lot of these class setups have been mixed up. I've been making singular videos on each of my class setups from, you know, last couple of weeks but i figured i'd just go ahead and kind of combine all the class setups that i'm using right now as well as some that i haven't really shown on video and just keep you guys updated because a lot of things have changed a lot of the vision setups have changed i don't run half of the class setups that i've made and showcased for you in my last 16 class setup video i don't think i've made one of these for about a month so i definitely feel like this is time to update you guys in some new best 16 class setups as well as throwing in my sensitivity settings because i know a lot of you guys who are new subscribers are always asking me i get that question a lot in the live stream so here we go let's get right into the video now my first class setup is going to be on the infantry stg44 you guys have seen this class setup used a lot from time to time you guys can swap infantry out for expeditionary if you guys want to I like to run grip rapid fire extended mag as well as high caliber you guys can run you know three attachment setup i would just drop off high caliber if you guys don't want to run infantry it is what it is whatever you guys want to run but I like running my rifles with infantry because you get that stock strafe speed. You don't really need to anymore, but it's still pretty good to run it. Another class I'd like to run is going to be the GOAT 2. Now this is going to be with the Volk, same exact attachment loadout, basic training with Forge. Keep in mind, every time I do run an infantry class setup, I have on Forge because unfortunately, they did take away the extra ammunition. So it, you kind of have to run Forge unless you want to be scrambling for weapons, which I don't think any of you guys want to do so that's kind of like why i run these class setups really really good you can't really go wrong with the volk and the stg definitely the two best assault rifles in the game as of right now and my next class setup is going to be my sniper class setup. now you guys are seeing a lot and i mean a lot of sniper v2 rockets on the channel i like to run the snipers with the resistance division now the reason why i'm running the resistance division with the snipers is because you actually do get built in lookout you have you know increased mini map coverage as well as you can see enemies from further away you get a scrambler as well as six cents now the reason why i like to run resistance and a lot of you guys might be saying dude you're an idiot running resistance it kind of gives away your position well if you guys think about it this way if you guys are trying to get v2 rockets and stuff like that odds are the players in the lobby are not that good maybe they are but a lot of the players that play this game currently that i'm running into don't even know how to run the raid they don't know how to use the uav they literally don't they just run you know blindly they don't look at the radar so if you just scramble it and you kind of have that directional targeting where they are it's kind of just a win-win for you so i would just run it if you play in a lot of people are actually looking at the radar just disable it it still allows you to have like the radar ping bubble as well and you get the bigger mini map and you get lookout so you can see enemies further away it's all good it's all gravy so i would definitely run this division Another class I have to run, same exact thing with, with the Car 98K, same exact attachments, uh, Ballistic CPU, FMJ, as well as Extended Mag. Guys know why I run Ballistic CPU, because it allows you to ADS with the Sniper, and you really honestly do not have to hold your breath if you have the Ballistic CPU. It kind of like slows down that sway, so sniping is legitimately easy mode when you have this on. You guys know when I play Aachen, kids are getting sniped out. It's nuts, so check this class setup. Also, I like to run Shifty. I didn't mention this earlier in the other class setup. Shifty with the pistols is pretty good. So you don't have to run Lookout. So you can actually swap that out and put Shifty on. So you have unlimited ammo with the pistol and you have an additional secondary. Let me tell you guys, the M19 with steady aim and extended mags is pretty much a shotgun, bro. It's really good. Two shot kill from close range is really good. Just hip fire it, it'll get the job done and you'll stay on your street. Now the class up, I like to run is going to be the grease gun now the grease gun fantastic with resistance these are going to be some of my free for all class setups you guys have actually seen me run these in ctf using a submachine gun resistance obviously in free for all you get to see where people are if they're in corners hiding with that directional so it is really really good i like to run quick draw extended mag as well as rapid fire it's something about the grease gun with quick draw i like this weapon with quick draw this is probably the only weapon in my entire class setup loadup that I use with quick draw, so check it out. I definitely think it's a fantastic class setup. A lot of you guys have actually copied this setup and have seen, you know, really good results. So make sure you check it out. Another class setup I like to run is gonna be the Sterling with grip, extended mag, as well as rapid fire resistance with forage. Obviously, you guys know. I don't really think I need to keep 
reminding people on the basic training. If you're not running expeditionary, obviously you need forge for limited ammo because you don't want to be picking up weapons off the ground because odds are the people that are running these class setups are running, not running my class setups, probably have some like ACOG STGs or something like that. So you don't want to pick up some whack weapons. So that's why I like to run forage. Uh, pretty much the same exact thing. Secondary, doesn't really matter. You don't really need it because you have on forage. Another class setup is gonna be the Duck Suit PPSH. You guys saw a 131 kill streak uh, or kill game, excuse me, with this class setup. Really, really good resistance forage. You guys already know it's disgusting with this setup. Uh, check it out. Another class setup is gonna be the Armored and Scoped Lewis. Now this is a filth class setup. This is so good. You guys have seen some gameplays in the past with this exact setup. Got FMJ extended mag as well as rapid fire now the reason why i run armored with fmj is because armor if you guys are unaware it allows you to have great or greater bullet penetration so if you stack this with fmj you can shoot through the entire map now i'm telling you guys this specifically on shipment if they're hiding behind the c flag you guys can shoot straight through the dumpster with ease they die in like three to four bullets when you have armored and fmj if you don't have on armored and fmj um, it does take a little bit amount of bullets to kill them but if you have them both stacked up you can literally just shoot clean through it and they're not getting away from it so i definitely recommend you guys run armored with this setup scope you guys have additional movement speed uh, this is kind of like a sweaty lewis class setup so if you guys are trying to stay alive and just you know destroy people on shipment this is definitely my number one go-to class setup the other setup is going to be armored blitzkrieg same exact thing uh pretty much run this if you're playing like something like gridiron or a mode that isn't 100 points of kill so you get your streaks faster really 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 good i would check this class setup out it is fantastic another setup is going to be the armored grease gun class setup same exact attachment same exact everything is that i just have the armored division on this is if you're playing maybe a free-for-all match and you guys do not like running resistance you guys can check out this setup it's fantastic when you have armored with the submachine gun uh you practically have no flinch especially with the grease gun so you guys can run and gun and just rip it up and just go ham another class setup is going to be the armored ppsh same exact thing uh, i'll have a lot of streamlined class setups where i run the same attachments for a lot of my weapons very very good uh obviously you guys have probably seen a lot of kids and pubs run armored ppshs so you guys know i have to throw that class setup in this is a very very good class setup in the game i know a lot of you guys are probably going to copy this one down just take it uh it's fantastic you guys have seen plenty of v2 rockets with this class setup in use now going on to my expeditionary and this is when things kind of get a little mixed up a little you know freaky i have blitzkrieg on now the reason i want blitzkrieg is because with expeditionary you have a double lethal plus tactical you replenish your munitions and you could throw them further and you have equipment damage plants enemies on the mini map so this is the setup i would recommend you guys running if you guys are in a god lobby and you just want to get an easy v2 rocket just run this especially in a free-for-all gridiron domination just a fantastic in my opinion expeditionary is the best division in the entire game you literally have like four perks so i would definitely check it check it out and run this uh ppsh same exact thing two babies two stuns just throw them around the map and it's like having a vsat man it's so good another setup it's going to be the same exact thing with the, the, the grease gun you guys already know fantastic class setup so if you guys like the ppsh or the grease gun run either or those are the two best smgs in my opinion another setup is going to be the armored or not excuse me the expeditionary with the lewis with blitzkrieg so you guys can kind of spam these explosives uh fantastic you guys are trying to post up on um, you know gridiron or like domination or something like that fantastic setup uh lewis class setup. you've seen this used multiple times it's uh it's filthy. Another setup is going to be the MP40. Now, i got to keep you guys up with the MP40. MP40 is buffed and better than ever. Uh, advanced rifling, extended mag, as well as rapid fire. You don't need grip on the MP40 because they reduce the recoil. Uh, you need rapid fire, in my opinion. It absolutely melts and shreds. Check it out. You guys have seen me get V2s with this setup over and over and over again. It is a really, really good, solid class setup. Check it out. Uh, now, another one's going to be on the Sterling. Now, the Sterling is a really really good smg in my opinion this is probably one of my favorite smgs in the entire game it's not the best smg but i just like it it's kind of like the grease gun but i kind of like the iron sights a little bit better fatal elegance to sterling check it out advanced rifling extended mag as well as rapid fire just an overall beast class setup. you guys have seen me get a v2 with this one as well so those are my 16 best class setups let me show you guys my streaks now if you guys are trying to get some easy vicious metals obviously you want to run uav firebomb paratroopers ball turret gunner 
easy mode. You get one side of these, you're practically already at a vicious mode. Because once you get that 15 kill streak with the ball turret gunner, you're gonna be able to get your V2. You got your paratroopers going off. You're in the ball turret gunner with Witch Creek, which is absolutely insane. And kids are just gonna get mowed down. So I recommend checking that out. Now I'm going go to my settings. I'm gonna be running some of the controls. Button layout's gonna be tactical. Uh, disable stick layout is going to be default look inversion disabled sensitivity is going to be on four five now i love this sensitivity setting i'm not changing it ever again in this game four five in my opinion is the best you can turn on people you can snipe with the sensitivity so make sure you guys check this out control vibration is disabled aim assist rotation enabled slow down enabled auto weapon switch is enabled auto mantle disabled and airborne hustle is disabled i don't even run airborne no hustle hustle because they're absolutely useless in this game so yeah those are my best 16 class setups in all of call of duty world war ii hope you guys do enjoy hope you guys go ahead and check out these class setups um they allowed me to get you know over close to like 300 v2 rockets and yeah so hope you guys do enjoy i'm gonna show you guys a v2 rocket with one of these class setups because what's a best 16 class setup video without some v2 rocket proof that these setups are actually good hope you guys do enjoy have a great rest of your day and uh yeah man <laughs> PPSH suppressed. Saboteur C4. Oh man, I don't even think about that. I don't even, even think about that class, dude. I just need a lobby. I mean, there's two setups in this game that I can't stand. No, three setups in this game that I just can't stand. Saboteur C4s. Come on, I can't stand mountain, S mountain suppressed SMGs. And I can't stand airborne fire shotgun. So the three class setups I just cannot stand. Why are you in the stand. game, dude? You're 5 and 32 in here. Stuff slapped up, homie. This, like, oh my, using assassin. The grind is real in the AM. Yeah, I like to. I do. I open them up in the AM because there's a lot. There's a lot more people. Um, I like in the stream in the AM. So I feel like you're, I might as well open up the supply drops where everybody's like actually in the stream. You know. That's the only gun people use in this game is the ACR. Recon aircraft awaiting order. Hey. Recon searching for. I got sniped, boys. Plus the lobbies are plus the lobbies are nice. So if I, I mean, if I, I'm not gonna get anything that I don't have already. Though that's the thing. I'm probably gonna get straight duplicates out. The, no, actually, no. I take that back. Honestly, when I out this bribe, I dead ass think I'm going to unlock the. Uh, I think I'm gonna get the Red Baron too. In all honesty. Talk to this girl, Dude, my teammates are we got flight I think we're gonna pull the Red Baron too, guys. Okay, I thought that fool was lying down. Hey Siri, call Caleb. Hey Siri. Oh, soft. Yeah, that is soft. Thank Where God he didn't you? say, he said call Caleb. Yo, Brody, oh, appreciate God. that, bro. Huh? I was about to... Oh, hell. Sure, Jace. I see. Dude. Push the zone. sucks so bad on my team. I think I'm, I'm 11 and 1. And this team is 2 and 9. Like, why are you playing this game? Who's here but camp up top and pick these losers off with the Lewises? I'll be chilling in the back with a sniper. I'm not going to lie to you all. Oh, will catch me at. Look at this kid sitting in the fucking corner, dog. With an ACR. Guys, I really hit 2.2 We got flight concluded. Like tonight. Tonight, we're gonna try to do it. On the game. On the ground squad. Oh! 
Oh god, dude. Oh, god. This... I just guys, I just uh, let's go, guys. That's number two, boys. In 20 minutes. Let's go, boys. Bobby's are fucking hot right now. Let's go.